Welcome aboard the Norwegian Escape everybody, my name is Bram and I have another amazing port for you today, Athens. Ever since we've left Rome the consistent factor has been the high temperatures and today is no different. It's been sizzling hot and I must admit it's lowering our level of activity quite a lot. But I can't let every port go by unseen so I'm determined to do some sightseeing today. In case you're new to this channel, on this cruise I'm accompanied by two close friends, both first time cruisers, Kun and Hendrik. They're getting ready as we speak and I should too. Super hot today, super hot. I think it's about 92. I'm on my way to the cabin which has felt quite crowded with the three of us. Let's hope they cleaned up a bit and most of all find them with clothes on. I've seen too many naked men this cruise. Is it clear now? Yeah. All right, I'll show you the cabin later when everybody's dressed or at least 50% dressed. It's not that kind of channel. So today, welcome to Piraeus, Greece. Plans for today, we're uh, be heading out to Athens, spend a couple of hours there, do some hiking around and see what we see. I'll take you along. So it's about noon now. I was planning on uh, getting something to eat, but um, way too hot. So no food for me. We had a couple of drinks, Pepsi at uh, Spice Stage 2O. Enjoyed uh, the refreshing ice cold water of the Grotto. And um, now it's time for a, uh, a quick shower and then we'll just take one of those uh, taxis over there. Uh, they say about, it's about a 20 minute drive and um, like I said, we'll take you along and fill you in on how, what, where, if uh, Athens would be on your list or on your itinerary. It's very quiet here now. So that's why we um, spend the morning on board and then the afternoon we go out. Uh, once when everybody start coming back, that's when we leave and the other way around. We'll see what we'll see and you'll be there. Welcome to Bram Season Day. Okay, Kun, you have some clothes on now? Yes. I do. Or do you want to share anything, any particular body parts with the audience? No, thank you. Like I said, it's not that kind of channel. So this is our cabin. I'll show you what uh, a cabin looks like if three guys are sharing. So that's the... Uh, Couch is my spot, Kun's spot, and then Hendrik. You see, we like to keep it nice and tidy. It is very important. We uh, talked about this uh, before. Every item, every item has its own uh, location, its own spot, and uh, and then uh, it works. So, phone is always middle of the bed, and shoes will be somewhat over there um this is how we do it we 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 got it all figured out so it's 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 working quite well see you later okay so we're gonna we decided on doing the uh, historic city center of athens um just for a couple of hours it's it's way too hot to walk around all day so just a couple of hours i'll cut that down to just a couple of minutes for you so let's do um athens the historic the city center of athens in five minutes with ramsey today Oh, 
aufgenommen. Ja. Dann die Sachen, die von mir gesehen haben. Die Rum in Armeen. Und auch die Lieben. Und dann die Dame, die noch was sagen. Die Hälfte und von Süß. Ja. Und dann damit beenden. Und dann können wir noch ein klein bisschen verwenden. Ähm. All the way down. Ich hoffe, ihr seht nichts. Na, da. So all aboard time is 5.30, normally all aboard time for crew would be 5, 5.30 for passengers and then a half hour after that. Uh, yeah, yesterday was uh, 9 and for crew 8. Because of the tender. The tender. Yeah, we spent an evening at the casino last night. His first time ever playing blackjack. It was nice. He didn't clear the place, but I think we, we played like four hours, so uh, and that was fun. Uh, not so much fun for Kuhn over here, who uh, gave everything to the house. I'm a giver. And then I think what you lose but you lost, we've won. You're welcome. So, if we would be real good friends, we could just give our winnings to you and everybody's break even and everybody's happy. But we, we won't be doing that. That's just my heart, bro. I'm saying I would. I won't, but I would. Enjoy it while it lasts. I doubt it, but yeah, let's find out. Thank you. We have one plan and one plan only, taxi to the Parthenon and take it from there. But I have a feeling this gentleman is looking to extend that plan as much as possible. But let's hear him out, why not, you never know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, just walk around and, and then come back. Uh, everything. Everything. Wow. Okay. Easy. Just Slowly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. Come. How much? For that three, five o'clock you're going to back here, okay? Yeah. yeah. For all of you, it's a hundred euro. For all of you. Both ways. You go to Acropolis, uh, uh, Temple of Zeus, original Olympic Stadium, you see if we have a time the change of the guard, I try, you see the change of the guard, and come okay. back here. Wait, 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 so it, right. it's like a race? A race? He's a race! I hope I win. Hands on the steering wheel is clearly optional, so this tour is not for the faint at heart. But it's definitely moving forward, and to my surprise, Costas is very to the point and informative. 
He's clearly on a mission to take us from point A to B to C. Compared to the guys on the tour buses, he has not asked us, How is everybody doing today? Are you excited? I can't hear you. Nor has he informed us about the percentage of local religions. I should do this more often. This is my style. The only thing missing is a drink and an opera, <laughs> Hendrik said, but it's time for the pièce de résistance, the Acropolis. Because of its altitude and lack of shade, temperatures are a lot higher. It's easily 10 degrees more than the 92 at the bottom, they said. And they were right. Sun lotion in the ice. Not the best feeling. Olympic Stadium, okay? Alright. From that stadium start the modern Olympic Games at 1896. Now we use that stadium only for two ceremonies. We light the flame every four years before the Olympic Games, we light the flame in Olivia. Flame come here, we have a ceremony with a lot of people inside and after give the flame and the president of the country of the Olympic Games. Because it's open, all our people stand outside and take only photos. It's very quickly that. Yeah. Okay. Yes. You go there, you take your photos, and uh, you come to the guard to go to the change of the guards. In and out. Right. Right. What time is the change of guards? Uh, exactly, it's uh, 420 front of the Royal Palace. All right. We go front of the Royal Palace because it's better for you. Yeah. Front of the Parliament, it's very hot area, and uh, a lot of people go there. Yeah. In the Royal Palace, we haven't so many people, and we have a shadow there. Yeah. Ah, at the right is a kiosk with original souvenirs from that stadium. You talk about them uh, at the other side. Okay. Which you want to see Quick, quick, one to the next. I told you Athens in uh, three hours. Or for you, Athens in five minutes. We're gonna make it. It's a race. It's a race. It's a race. It's a race. I win. I win. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Did I get that on camera?
this, ladies and gentlemen, is taking me by surprise. It's my unexpected highlight of the day. I don't want to offend the Acropolis or the Olympic Stadium, but the changing of the guards is what I'll remember most when looking back on Athens. These soldiers have gone through four intense weeks of training for this. Hear this. During their one-hour shifts, they're not allowed to blink their eyes. No movement whatsoever unless instructed to. How can you not blink for 60 minutes? That's crazy! Their shoes have heavy nails, making them weigh 3 kilos each. That's 7 pounds on every foot. Attach a gallon of water to each foot and try it at home. Pure madness. Only the best of the best get to do this. All while I've been complaining about the heat all day. Very humbling. And another special shout out to Costas for getting us to this location. The other location to see the changing of the guards is at the Hellenic Parliament. And although it's more impressive, it's also very touristy and no shade. At the Royal Palace, we are the only ones here. Costas 20 euro for this amazing quick tour, making it 120, so 40 euro each. Compared to the ship organized tours of 150 and up, we had an amazing deal. No waiting on others, no head counts, no lines, no buses. I highly recommend you to try a taxi tour on your next cruise at least once. Just ignore that hands-on steering wheels are optional. We end our day like we started it, in the shade at Spice H2O with some ice-cold drinks. And the grotto is standing by around the corner. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Hit that like button for me and as always, thanks for watching.